Well, how do there, chums? I'm back inside of Pow World. Whoops, I didn't mean to pick up my pal. Okay, go over there. All right, cool. And, um, yeah, I need to pick up my arrows. Oh, for fudge sake, I'll just keep picking this guy up. There we go. All right, here we are. I'm trying to pick up my arrows, and now I need to craft the arrows. Now, I've got 31 arrows to craft. This is going to take me a little while, and I just threw my pal that was helping me just over there somewhere. So, yeah, that didn't go out too well. That wasn't a very good start to my video. But today, chums, I need to get some wheat, because I need to make wheat fields. So if I head on over here, I'll show you the mission that I'm sort of stuck on right now. If I go into missions, lovely. Build a wheat plantation. Well, for me to build a wheat plantation, if I go into food, wheat plantation, I need wheat seeds, which is the only commodity that I don't know where to get it. So I've looked online, I've looked for a couple of videos, and I've found that there are a couple of pals that give wheat seeds, and there's also some vendors that will sell wheat seeds. So, yeah, I'll be doing either of those two things. So I'll reconvene once I've made my arrows, and we'll go on an adventure. Okay, all right. Now, apparently, one of the pals that I'm after that can actually make these wheat is in this sort of starting area down by the lake down here. Sometimes oh, there he is. That that see that big green guy with the pink thing on his head. That's who I'm after. Let's go catch a Kate him. Okay, now he can be quite difficult. I have brought myself. Um, let's land behind him. Let's just throw a sneaky freaking pal ball at him. If you get behind them, you get a you get a plus bonus to the catch rate. It's only five percent. No, that didn't work, did it? All right, fine. That's that's angered him. Okay, I'm gonna use my bow on him. Pow! Okay, that's not doing much damage. Right, I'm gonna bring out my um, I'm gonna bring out a pal. Oh no, wrong button. Okay, right. So go this way and pow. Get him, pal. Holy fudge, I'm gonna die. I'm not careful. Get him! Freaking get him! Lovely. Hopefully he's gonna get burn damage. There we are. He's, he's on fire now. Right, now I need to retract my pal before he actually kills him. Oh great, my pal just fell off a cliff. Alright, if that happens, you can just recall your pal and then redeploy your pal. Now he's already got burn damage. Oh, oh, no. No, don't kill him. Oh, for fudge sake. Um, well, that, that seems to happen quite a lot, people. Oh, well, well that one's dead. Right, I'm going to wait for my health to recharge. And I'm, I swear I saw another one of these big green guys just over at the opposite side of this area here. He, there was one just walking around just over this way. He's disappeared. Dang it. Where's he gone? He was just here a second ago. All right, well, I'll look for him, people, but if that doesn't work, I might have to go and buy some wheat fields type stuff. There he is, right there. I see him. Okay, right. Let's um, let's get his attention. Slap a jack! Go get him, fire dude! This time, don't kill him. Oh, no. He dazed my fire dude straight away. Go on, get him! Get him! Ow! Fudging heck. I have to pay more attention to the screen. Get him, get him, get him. Am I recording? Yes, I am. Boom. Okay. Get in the queue. Oh, for fudge sake, you killed him again. Oh, man. Um, sorry. Well, that's him dead then. I wonder if that gave me some wheat pieces anyway. Let's have a look see if it's got wheat seeds in here now. Yes, I've got some wheat seeds for killing him. So we can go and do my wheat plantation now, people. So even if you don't catch him, you just kill him. You might get given some wheat seeds. So I'll head back up to my base and we'll get the wheat seeds put in. I guess. Okay, chums, well, that's my wheat mill there. So hopefully I can put a little wheat patch around the back here. That's the idea anyway. I just need some more wood. I need 35 wood. How's this going for wood? Have we got some wood? We've got 12 wood there. Have they put any in my box for me? Um, no. No, they haven't. They haven't. What about in this box? No. Nope. All right, I'll go and hack down a tree then. Okay, well, I just hacked down a tree. Let's just put in my wheat field. And there we go, wheat plantation. Oh, it's quite large, actually. Didn't expect it to be so big. But we'll stick that about there, I think, people. There we are. Go and build. And you know what? I'm going to put down a little sort of, like, feed box next to it as well. There we are. And I can just leave them to build that. Lovely jubbly. 
Hopefully once that's actually done, I'm going to go up a level. Oh, so we'll see what we have to do for the next stage of progression. Go, my little pals. I mean, I can go over and help them if I want. There we go. Boom, boom. Get it done that a little bit quicker. So the orange is going orange. It's like it's 3D printing or something. Lovely. That's that done. What about this? What about the little feed basket, guys? Come on. Yeah, earn your wage. Chicka Done. Now, hopefully, they're going to. Um, yeah, they're putting in wheat in there already. There we are. We're planting the wheat. There you go. I'll help them. Lovely. I mean, we only got like three wheat seeds from killing those green guys earlier. I didn't mean to kill them. If you manage to capture one of those green guys and then assign them to your ranch, they sometimes drop wheat seeds. So you can get this, you know, perpetually going the whole freaking time. Now, I have got an actual pal here that will water this as well. So there we go. The little guy's going to come over and start watering that in a moment. I'll just let them complete doing that. But I think we're done now. If I go over to this and go to missions, we're done. Base upgrade. Chicka pow pow, chicka boom boom. Build a weapons workbench. Heck yes, I will. Okay, um, where do I find that? Weapons workbench. It's not in there. Batch bear traps. Productions. Weapons. Weapons. Weapons workbench. It's not in there. Maybe I have to unlock it in the tech tree first or something. It, maybe it doesn't auto unlock. Hmm. Yeah, that's probably what's happening. Let's go into the old tech tree then. And let's have a look see if we can find this weapons workbench amongst all of this then. Items, items, weapons workbench. Where are you, weapons workbench? I, I, I'll look for this and I'll see if we can find it. There you go, people. I found it. It's under level 20. Weapons workbench. There we are. We'll get that. Oh, Giga Spear. Heck yes. We'll unlock that as well. How many technology points? I've got 19 points left to spend, people. Give me a sec. I'm going to spend them. Okay, well, something that I just unlocked was a musket, gunpowder, and bullets. So hopefully we can make that at our new bench. Antique desk set. Oh, it's just for show, is it? Right, I'm not too fussed about that then. Bear traps. We've got a stun baton. Well, that might make them easier to catch if they're freaking stunned. I don't know where you get an electric organ from, though. But I'm going to unlock it anyway, because that seems awesome. Metal armour. Heck yes. I only need a load of ingots. A heck of a lot of ingots, but yeah. Metal helm as well. Brilliant. Oh, and a lovely fountain. Heck yes, we'll have that then. A fluffy power bed. All right. Um, I can make all that sort of stuff, so why not? We can upgrade their beds. Flower beds, but I've heard that you get to unlock a second base at some stage. So what I might do is um, make myself a, a really cool second base at some stage when we get that far. Makeshift handgun, single shot handgun, created from spare parts, required to fire. Okay, high quality pal oil. Don't know where to get that. All right, well I might keep those three points just in case you know I've got to do something with it. But anyway, let's, let's head, head back on into here. I keep pressing the wrong button for run. And let's put in this weapons bench. Where is it? Is it inside production, maybe? Weapons workbench. Heck yes. We'll have that. Okay, no, we won't, because we need more wood and we need nails. I'll be back when I've got all the sort of resources I need. Okay, people, I've got enough to make my workbench now. So let's go and stick the workbench. Oh, cool. It's got guns around it. This is going to look excellent inside of my little base. Yes, I guess it will. I can't fit much else in here, but this is something I definitely want in here. Just get right against the wall or as close as I can to the wall. There we are. Let's go and build this then. Hiya! Tally ho! It's going to take 48 seconds. I'll be back with you once it's built. There we go, people. We reconvene. We're pretty much there. Some of my pals came to help me. Lovely jubbly. Done. Awesome. Right, what can I make on this lovely bench then? So, yeah. Oh, I can make this, but I need ingot. High quality pal oil, which I don't know how to make. I need ingot and gunpowder. Well, where's gunpowder inside of this menu? You would have thought it would have been in here, wouldn't you? But it's not. Okay, all right, fine. I've got a little bit of learning to do there, people. Have I made one of these yet? I haven't. A meat cleaver, which is good for sort of like, I guess, killing off your pals. Let's make one of them. I haven't got one of them. All right, there we are. We'll have that then. I'll get this equipped. And we'll, we will put one of my little um, sheep characters under the blade, shall we, people? Okay, well, I'm just running around with this giant blade. Oops, didn't want to do that. Didn't want to do that. Okay. 
<clears throat> okay, I can actually use this as well anyway. All right, fine. Well, I guess for me to actually butcher my creatures, I'm going to have to go into my pow box and put the ones I want to butcher into my group. Yeah. So we're going to butcher all of these. Lovely. I don't know whether I'm going to butcher all of them. That might be a little bit overkill. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah. Oh, that one's got an ability. Login foreman. Oh, that one's pacifist. He can go. He can definitely go. Let me just check that none of the mothers mine informant and he's brave. All right. I want to swap him for one that's rubbish. Destructive. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So who have we got? Downtrodden pacifist. He's got no skills. He's destructive. He's a pacifist. These are a bunch of freaking useless ones. Okay, right. Well, let's uh, go on over here then. Let's uh, call him out. And I guess we go over to the... Um... Oi, come here, you. Lambo. Oi. And put your Lambo. Oh, it pixels it all. I can't see what's happening. Um, all right, well that's that's him done then, I guess. All right, well let's uh, let's get the next one then. <laughs> uh, chicka pow, and um, butcher. Come here, you. Okay. And I, I I guess we don't get to see what happens. All right, fine. I don't know whether I actually gained anything for doing that. Did I get any resources? Let's have a look. Did I get any resources? I think I might have got some meat. And what's this thing? Precious pelt? Hmm. Okay, you can sell it for a high price, maybe. Did I get that? I'm not 100% sure. Let's do another one, just to be blinking sure, shall we? All right. I summon you, Lambord! Butcher him. Right, let's watch what we get over at the left-hand side this time. <laughs> Um, it didn't really show much. Maybe it's because the mission marker's still showing on screen. I don't know. But there you go. Butchering them. The other pals went up a level. What the fudge? Okay, right. Here we go. Let's go into here then. Why? We've done that now then. So we can upgrade that. Cool. Fluffy pal bed. Brilliant. Deploy a work pal to the base. Okay. Well, I'm running out of work pals at this rate and I'm butchering them all. Not that they're any good anyway. They've all got pretty much bad stats. So I might as well just carry on with that. There we go. Hello. Butcher him. I don't know whether I'm getting anything useful for this, but, you know, you're dead now. So that, that's the end of you. Cool. All right. Well, we've only got one left, I think. I summon you! Butcher Lamble. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Lovely noises. Yeah, you, oh, there we go. We got uh, lamb, mutton, and wool times six. Brilliant. I don't think I've actually got any pals left in my um, box anymore. I need to go and get some pals. All right, let's go do that then. And then I need to go capture cakes and more pals from my farm. So we are. Oh, we've still got a couple of lamb balls, but these are all quite good ones, aren't they? All right, well, I want him in my party because he's awesome. Um, I'll take that one as well pretty darn big. I'm going to take this guy and I'll take you and I think we'll take the dire wolf with us. So they're my toughest ones that I've got so far people. Now I could just assign a couple more of these to the base for now. I mean a lot of them have got like pretty good stats anyway. So I could put them on there to help out for a bit. What does he actually do? I don't know whether he does too much. Oh he plants and he drop stuff. Oh, okay, well, let's put him in there. Let's see what he does then. Pow. There we are. And he does a bit of planting. So we get him in there for now anyway. We might as well leave those here. They're not doing anything. Right then. So why? I've done that now. I just need fluffy pow beds apparently. All right, fluffy pow beds. Let's go into the old infrastructure into beds. Fluffy pow bed. I need wood and nails. Well, I can get all of that in my own time. I'll be right back, people. Okay, so I need to make two of these beds. And I've got enough to make at least one, anyway. I can make one for now. So let's go stick that over by the rest of these beds. Let's stick this one here. Okay. And X. There we are. Let's start that building. Get them building that. I need to go make one more set of nails. There we are. Let's go make these nails. And then I can make a second bed. And then that should complete that mission. Which would be lovely and jubbly. Yeah, got it out. Come on. Yep, yeah, almost there. But they're going mental on that bed, aren't they? Let's make another one. Here we go. 
Insufficient materials. I haven't got enough cloth. Hmm. Okay. Um, I think I've got some wool, so I can make some cloth. Let's go over here and let's see. If... I might even have some cloth inside one of these. Um, what's this? This is wool, so I can take that. Um, actually, I should be able to just go over to the bench and make it from those boxes, shouldn't I? So if I hit cancel on there for a second. Yes, cancel. Select recipe. And I want to make some cloth. I just want to make one cloth. There we are. Yeah, start production. Don't need to go mental. Acquire the cloth. I should be able to make the last bed. Let's go and put this bed down then. Pow. Now put that next to this one. Why the fudge not? There we are. And let's go and build this with these guys. It's going to take 57 seconds. Right, I won't waste your 57 seconds, people. Okay, there we go. Bed done. Now, I have noticed in the top where it says tutorial, it says to go and fight my first boss. So I might do that on the next episode, peeps. But for now, I'm just going to upgrade my base a little bit more. So here we are. Base upgraded. Nice. Build a Spheres Factory level 2 and build a power generator. All right, well, I think I've done enough here for now without going to beat the first boss. So I'm going to go and beat the first boss and see what happens. Oh, I think I picked up an egg earlier, so I'm just going to leg it into here and put the egg in the incubator. Might as well, mind we? There we are. Stick that inside of the egg ink. Oh, press the wrong button, I guess. There we are. It's in there. And that should take a minute or so. I'll tell you what, I'll show you what I get inside this egg machine. And then uh, then I'll end off, peeps. Okay, chums, while the egg is incubating, I figured I'd make a bit more cloth. And pick that cloth up. We go over here, we pick up these ingots that we've almost got. Ingots got, lovely. Oh, where's he gone? Why is, why is he not... Yeah, get back to work, you! Yes, lovely. Okay, we'll head back into here, because I'm wondering whether I might have enough to craft the metal armour, which we're definitely going to need if we're going to go do a boss fight next episode. Pelt armour? No, I was after the uh, metal armour. Where's the metal armour gone then, people? There it is, right there. I need, I need another 15 ingots. So I'm probably going to be focusing on that for next episode, peeps. Hopefully we'll have all the ingots got. Yes, ingots got. And by the time we, we, we reconvene, let's see what we get inside of this egg machine then. Okay, I'm holding it. I am holding it. Oh, we've got to hold it a little bit longer, have I? All right, fine. what I get? Oh, my days! Wow. Is that a flying creature? Okay. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Let's have a look at him. Who are you, mate? How do I just how do I just see pow deck? Okay. Um where is he inside the pow deck? Alright, let me find him and I I'll get back to you in a second, people, unless Okay, this is a bit There he is. Oh wow. Okay, well that's a bit different, isn't it? Alright, what does he actually do? He just does watering. Alright, well he he doesn't fly either. I thought he was awesome. He's not that awesome. Yeah. Might have to butcher him for pow fluid. <laughs> Golly, yeah. Anyway, well, that's him. There you go, people. I'm going to go get some more ingots. And hopefully, by the time we reconvene, I'll be at the point where I can make my armour. And then we're going to go look for this first boss. Yeah. So there we go, people. Slutamondo, thank you very much for joining me this episode. Hopefully you're liking my Power World series. If you are, hit that like, hit the subscribe, and yeah, share it out on social media platforms. Get people looking at my Power World content. That'd be lovely. Till next time, Slutamondo. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again, people in the viewerverse.